Uh, if you see the Fourier series formula, f of x is equal to some constant a naught by 2 plus a1 cos x plus b1 sin x. When n is equal to 1 to infinity, you have to apply for n is equal to 1. So a1 cos x plus b1 sin x. Next to you have to apply n equal to 2. So a2 cos 2x plus b2 sin 2x. n equal to 3. So a0 by 2 plus a1 cos x plus a2 cos 2x plus a3 cos 3x plus a4 cos 4x etc. plus a n cos nx plus it may go to infinity. In the similar way, plus b1 sin x plus b2 sin 2x plus b3 sin 3x plus b4 sin 4x plus etc. plus bn sin nx plus it goes to infinity. Okay. So therefore, we are writing in general Fourier series f of x is equal to a naught by 2 plus summation n equal to 1 to infinity a n cos n x plus b n sin n x. Now we are going to study the harmonic. Okay. Now you can see here the harmonic. The harmonics means harmonic function. Harmonic function means what is it? The Fourier series f of x is equal to a naught by 2 when n is equal to 1 a1 cos x plus b1 sin x a1 cos 1x plus b1 sin 1x this is called as simple harmonic or first harmonic understand so f of x is equal to a naught by 2 plus in the Fourier series formula, you have to apply n is equal to 1 only. So a naught by 2 plus a1 cos x plus b1 sin x. This is called as simple harmonic or first harmonic. Okay, sir. Second harmonic that is f of x is equal to a naught by 2 plus a1 cos x plus a2 cos 2x plus b1 sin x plus b2 sin 2x. Third harmonic, f of x is equal to a naught by 2 plus a1 cos x plus a2 cos 2x plus a3 cos 3x plus b1 sin x plus b2 sin 2x plus b3 sin 3x. This is the third harmonic, understand? So you have to find in the question there will be find the first harmonic that means it will be very easy to solve because f of x equal to a naught by 2 plus a1 cos x plus b1 sin x if in the question paper if there is a find a two harmonics two harmonics means f of x is equal to a naught by 2 plus a1 cos x plus a2 cos 2x plus b1 sin x plus b2 sin 2x Okay, so here 0 to 2 pi, you can see the problem is compute the first two harmonics of the Fourier series of y is equal to f of x from the data. In the data, there is a x f of x. So x values are 0, pi by 3, 2 pi by 3, pi, pi 4 pi by 3, 5 pi by 3, 2 pi y is equal to f of x. So that is given 1, 1, 1.4, 1 1.9, 1.7, 1.5, 1.2, 1.0. The x values, that is the interval 0 to 2 pi. 0 to 2 pi can be divided into some sub intervals using pi by 3. We are dividing into 
finite number of sub intervals 0 to 2 pi 0 to pi by 3 one stage pi by 3 to 2 pi by 3 another stage 2 pi by 3 3 to pi another stage pi to 4 pi by 3 4 pi by 3 to 5 pi by 3 5 pi by 3 to 2 pi so 0 is the starting one 2 pi is the ending one so therefore the limit is 0 to 2 pi okay so y values y we have taken as f of x so here the first two harmonic means i have written here first two harmonics of the fourier series is f of x is equal to a naught by 2 plus a1 cos x plus a2 cos 2x plus b1 sin x plus b2 sin 2x here we have to find the value of a naught a1 a2 b1 b2 okay so five values a naught a1 a2 b1 b2 these values we are going to find suppose if you have calculator change your calculator mode to radian r a d radian or else if you have the mobile phone you can use your mobile calculator there you have to change the mode to radian in scientific calculator go to scientific calculator there you have to press the rad radian okay so now that is the formula to find a naught a n b n what is the formula a naught is equal to 2 into summation fx divided by n or else y is equal to fx so instead of fx you can use y so 2 into summation y divided by n a n is equal to 2 into summation fx cos nx divided by n so which is equal to 2 into summation y cos nx by n b n is also 2 into summation fx sin nx divided by n. So these are the formulas to find a n b n. Suppose if you want to find a 1 means for n is equal to 1. So a 1 is equal to 2 into summation f of x cos x divided by n. The denominator n denotes the values. How many values are given? Here, the f of x values are 7 values are given but the starting value 1.0 ending value is 1.0 so both values are same so you have to omit the last value you have to omit the last value okay so therefore first and last value of y is equal to f of x is same that is 1.0 so omit last value now what is the value of a small n equal to 6 so in the formula denominator n is equal to 6 you have to use okay so after that for the formula a1 what we need f of x cos 1x a2 f of x cos 2x b1 f of x sin 1x b2 f of x sin 2x so these are we are going to find using the table so we have taken the table tabular column there we will use all the values okay so first column is x value x next one f of x these two values are given next one is the last value we have omitted so that that's why we cannot take 2 pi we will never consider the last value so 2 pi 1.0 so i have taken here so if you have calculator then only you can write i think here x values f of x values cos x cos 2x 
I mean, I am dividing the columns cos x cos 2x, f of x cos x, f of x cos 2x, sin x, sin 2x, f of x sin x, f of x sin 2x, because these need, okay, we require these all the values, if summation of f of x cos x, summation of f of x cos 2x, summation of f of x sin x, summation of f of x sin 2x, to find the value of a1, a2, b1, b2. That's why in t-tailed we have written the, we have filled the table value. Okay, cos x, what is the x value? 0. So cos 0, right? Cos 0, what ma? 1 sir, cos 0. Ah, yes ma, yes ma, very good. Cos 0, so 1. So after that, next one. Next one. So cos x. For cos x only, we are finding the value. Cos in the calculator, you have to radian mode, you have to change to radian mode. So after that, press cos within bracket pi divided by 3. Within bracket, you have to write pi divided by 3. Pi will be there. Shift, you have to write something. Pi will be there. Suppose if you have a calculator. Pi divided by 3. Now, if you work out, then only in the examination you can easily do this problem, or else 3 hours you will solve only this problem. You can see it will be very easy. Okay, so we have to use the calculator in the next class. Bring calculator, it will be very useful to you. Then only you can tell the Answers are values. Cos okay. By so, uh, cos, cos pi by 3, point 0.5 is on it. Cos pi by 3, point 0.5, right? What value you got, ma? Cos pi by 3. Okay, ma. So, cos pi by 3. So, one point. Uh. One by two, sir. Ah, yes, one by two. That is a point five, right? Cos two pi by three. Minus zero point five. Cos pi. So, without calculator, we cannot do anything. So, cos pi minus one. Cos four pi by three. Minus 0 0.5. Cos 5 pi by 3. First, you have to press cos. After that, open the bracket. Within that bracket, 5 pi by 3, close the bracket. Then equal to, you will get the answer. Okay. So, cos pi by 3. 5 by 2, sir. 0 0.5. So in this way, you have to find sign next to cos two x. Cos two into zero Tell me cos 2x. How to find cos 2x value? Cos 2x. Cos 2. X value is 0. Cos 2 into 0. You have to multiply. Cos 2 into 0 will be cos 0. So cos 0, 1. So after that, cos 2x. X is a pi by 3. So cos 2 pi by 3. Cos, you have to press cos within bracket 2 pi divided by 3. Close the bracket. Okay, equal to. You have to next to you have to press the equal to symbol. You will get the answer. Cos 2 pi by 3. 
next one is cos 4 pi by 3 because the 2x is there 2 into 2 pi by 3 will be cos 4 pi by 3 next cos 2 pi 181 sir ah, cos 2 pi 1 cos 2 pi is 1 because in the four exercises already we studied cos pi, cos 3 pi, cos 5 pi, these are minus 1. Cos 2 pi, 4 pi, 6 pi, 8 pi will be plus 1. Am I right? So cos 2 pi plus 1. Next cos 2x, x is a 4 pi by 3. So cos 8 pi by 3 minus 0 0.5. Cos 10 pi by 3. 10 divided 10 pi divided by 3. So minus 0 0.5. Next f of x cos x. f of x is here. 1. Cos x is here. 1. So you have to multiply and write here. That is very easy. But you have to find cos x, cos 2x carefully. You have to find. f of x cos 2x. f of x is 1. Cos 2x is 1. So you multiply and write here. The values f of x is 1.4 cos 2x is minus 0 0.5 multiply you will get minus 0 0.7 that is f of x cos 2x the similar way you have to find sin x sin 0 sin 0 0 sin pi by 3 suppose if you have calculated find and tell me what is the value sin pi by 3 Mobile also you can do the, do this calculation, okay, sign, sign will be there, sign, sign pi by 3, in calculator also there will be pi, yes ma, what is the answer ma, sign pi by 3, root 3 by 2. In calculator, it, uh, it is giving root by root three by two. Am I right, ma? No, sir. Sine pi by three value use, only. Use by use calculator. Okay, sir, so it's zero point eight. Zero point eight double six zero two. Yes, correct. Correct, correct. What you are telling, ma? Here we have to find the values. Okay, in decimal values, if you are writing root 3 by 2, okay, sometimes you don't know how to write. Sign 10 pi by 3, what is ma? We don't know. La. Yes, sir. Ah, that's why. So you have to use the calculator. Calculator, if you are using, you will get the round of values. Okay, it will be easy to calculate, I think. Okay, ma. So that is also correct, root 3 by 2. So sign pi by 3. So 0 0.87. Next to sign 2 pi by 3. What is the value ma? Sign 2 pi by 3. Santosh. Sir. Ah, sign 2 pi by 3. 2 pi divided by 3. Okay, tomorrow everyone must bring calculator, okay, must have calculator to work out these problems, okay. So, sine 2 pi divided by 3 is also 0 0.86602, am I right? Next, sine pi 0, sine 4 pi by 3. Minus 0 0.87. Sin 5 pi by 3 minus 0 0.87. In this way, sin 2x, 2 into 0, sin 0, 0. Sin 2 pi by 3, 0 0.87. Sin 4 pi by 3, minus 0 0.87. Sin 2 pi, 0. Sin 8 pi by 3, 0 0.87. Sin 10 pi by 3, minus 0 0.87. F of x sin x. 
f of x is 1.0 sin x is 0 so f of x sin x is 0 f of x sin 2x f of x values is given in the problem sin 2x value or sin x value we have got the values using the calculator we have got so these two you have to multiply if you multiply you will get f of x sin x as well as f of x sin 2x okay so the four five values are important summation f of x summation f of x cos x summation f of x cos 2x summation f of x sin x summation f of x sin 2x these are five values are important to find the a naught a1 a2 b1 b2 so a naught is equal to 2 into summation f of x divided by n n is already we know 6 so 2 into summation y divided by n summation y that is 8.7 divided by n 6 so 2 divided by 6 3 1 by 3 so 8.7 divided by 3 is equal to 2.9 a1 is equal to 2 into summation f of x cos 1x divided by n for n you can apply 6 summation f of x cos 1x minus 1.1 divided by 3 next f of x cos 2x minus 0 0.3 divided by 3 b1 summation f of x sin 1x divided by n b2 summation f of x sin 2x divided by n so a naught a1 b1 a2 b2 so in this way you have to find all the values the Fourier constants now after finding the these a naught a1 a2 b1 b2 values substitute in the formula f of x is equal to a naught by 2 a1 cos x plus a2 cos 2x plus b1 sin x plus b2 sin 2x 